Hello there, it is I, Ariman the Exile, and today we are playing uh, as a Space Marines, Blood Ravens to me, <laughs> against the uh, Chaos Marines, Alpha Legion. Yeah, yeah, that's it. And this is literally down of War 1. What are we doing here today? Uh, insane AI. Uh, so, with advanced tactics, this is gonna be interesting. Uh, map is called Colosseum Suicide. It is an uh, interesting name for a map, actually. And uh, let us, let us actually uh, begin this match. Oh yeah, before we start... You can see clearly this map is uh, from the campaign from Down the Four One, and you already know. And now, when you know, let's just uh, let's just do something real quick. I want to take picture of this beautiful map. Uh, there we go. It's gonna be very interesting to watch this episode. Yeah, now. When we are done with that, now let us begin. Alright, we got the Alpha Legion from Down Pool 1. This is literally Down Pool 1, but it is unification mode. So, <laughs> okay. The Chaos. Doing their Chaos, starting out with the cultists. Probably because it's got this uh, hoods and helmets from the Space Marines, so that even the cultists are like a little bit different locking as we can say and now they're building the generator and the chaos tent another cultist squad are going on what about uh, space marines? space we marines are, are chaos. Chaos producing heavy bolters force commander boreal and uh, generator oh, we're here to serve master Oh, Look at this beautiful map. It all, all, almost like uh, gets me back to to the good old times when I used to play down 4-1 when I finished that advice. campaign like over Anything and over for, for like powers. 10 times. <laughs> Not 10 times, but I kind of probably played it like 6 times Our how good that game was assured. actually when I was a kid. Uh, and I still love it. Like, that's the best uh, strategy game when I used to, like, remember from what strategies I used to play. That one made me, like, feel really good, really good about myself, so... Stay kids, guys. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. Uh, just stay in good kid shape. Alright, now, heretics are building this list of posts, alright? And there he is, Commander Boreo. He is also another reason why I'm playing this game. For God's sake, look how, how precisely this guy is. He shoots, he he never misses, he heals the heretics. <laughs> now, he has a plan with his chainsaw in his hands. What is he going to do? To use a bolt? Probably. <laughs> He, he's a legend, bro. Like, this is how weak, weakling these cultists are. Like, they, they, they cannot even touch his armor. He, his armor is OP, bro, as hell. Look at him. <laughs> now, the scouts have captured a couple of points around. And the heretics also got some of the points. But the uh, cultists don't know what are they up against here and the chaos lord elephant is on the field i'm i'm joking he's not the elephant he's commander of all alpha legion yes ladies and gentlemen there he is he got that sick chaos power sword he's a very angry guy but his face is really like tricky you know it's like you want to believe him, but you don't, because you have the better face and better bold face, Commander Bori. <laughs> no retreat, no surrender. Exactly. 
But he is kinda retreating here. He is not charging. Chaos Lord was charging Commander Boreal. But Commander Boreal used to retreat. <laughs> He's saying, never retreat, never surrender. And then he is running like <laughs> from the enemy. Like he is just using his tactics, you know. He, he, he's a commander. Oh, look at it, cultists. Cultist is no more. He's gone. Now we got some yes, chaos uh, space marines. Yeah, that's the full name of that. Like my friend used to say me, like, why are they even chaos space marines? This should be just chaos. I am like, at least give them chaos marines. That's okay, but you cannot like just delete those space marines because they came from the space marines. They are the space marines, bro. <laughs> what are we talking about here? And he said, no, bro. Like, chaos are just chaos. No chaos space marines. I was like, but wait, you got chaos demons also. Yeah, but they are chaos demons, you know? Like, no, okay. Whatever. <laughs> Yes, there are some things will like people will never agree on, but okay. <laughs> Doesn't matter. This map is beautiful. It reminds me a lot of that cruel times, you know, me. when I used to play it Down for One. I believe I finished on every single difficulty. We have it now. I'm not sure if I have it in the channel. Maybe I do, but I'm not sure. Alright, we got two tactical marine squads with Commander Boreal on the head, commanding those space marines to demolish this specific boss. Chaos. Now, left and right side. Oh, I also got the strategic point from the left side, and the right side is clearly mine. Now, we got uh, two generators. And Chaos space marines got one. No. They are going to second it seems. Demonic fire incoming for the Chaos Lord. Farius Ferverius Charon. Alright, that is I I hope I did spell it right. I hope. Alright. Now we get some sergeant updates here. For the glory of chaos, they say. This sergeant looks legit, he doesn't have a flag on his back, backpack, but he still looks pretty nice and legit with that helmet. And this sergeant got that flag on his backpack, as we can see. Alright, what is going on here? For the glory of chaos, uh, they are screaming. And complete squad of heretics are wiped out. They said they need enemies. Don't worry, I got something for you, heretics. Commander Pori are charging at those heretics. Even the missile launchers and plasma guns are added to this match out. You can see. Heretics has uh, one of those heretics going to repair this I believe not. Because my units got plasma guns and missiles. This is some uh, Aspirin champion from the cultist. But he will not survive the whole story. But he will. He actually will. Oh no, he won. Chaos Lord Charon is wiped out from the existence. He's not pretty anymore. <laughs> Alright, you can see the heavy turret shooting very angry at my force commander Boreal. Now Raptors added to this madness. Now they are going pretty angry it seems. Boost the damage for the dark gods. Who will eat the chainsaw here? I'm curious. And who will eat a hollow sword? And the Boreal is just.
just staying classic, bro. He got half HP, but he he is supporting his army very well. He is leading them. He knows what to do. He's the enemy who will save death in the field. It seems. And what is this? Yeah, story. Yo, Sorcerer Online, casting some abilities upon those Space Marines. But the Sorcerers and Psychers are really strong, it is what Hammer. Those are the two Raptor squads with Flamers on. What would be if I go for the Assault Marines? I believe they got Melt again. I'm throwing a couple of grenades now, it seems I have uh, upgraded uh, the, 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 the grenades, now I'm going for plasma pistol also. Okay, two raptor, two squads of raptors completely dead, and you have sorcerer. His face looking pretty fine, but now his face looking pretty dead. <laughs> Force commander Boreal. Leading his brethren to victory, letting him go. And what is this? A jetpack booster research. Why? Why do you need that? Even you don't even have a single rapid squad anymore. <laughs> Come on, man. that is funny. All right. Now they got two generators. Very soon. Space Marines will attack this one generator and that means they will have only one. Now the Land Speeder Tempest coming up. And I have a couple upgrades from the arm armory it seems. No, only one. <laughs> I have already probably research Bionics. And I am tier 2. And going for the... Length speeder attempt. Now even those scouts get plasma. Yeah, those abilities work very well on the scout holes. But Chaos Saucer is scared. He cannot face the Ember Boreal in combat. No chance, bro, he said. Going for another raptor, I'm sorry about that. Going for another raptor squad. Lander, Land Spear, Tempest upgraded with Crack Missiles, and we can go for the Crack, crack Missiles also. Now we can see. Alright, Assault Man is in the field, we get Melta Guns. They are all the main for the Melta Guns in this beautiful mall dedication. And there it is, is a trap one. Shepard knows what to do, like... And of course, Mender Warrior knows how to lose his army. This will be the last thing they can say. Heresy must be burned. Now they are trying to do some foolish here. They think they, that will help them, but I'm not sure of that. Okay, we can see they are completely wiped out from the existence and this is why I love this. I love you. We love to see this Meltagans upgrade. I mean the Exile have uh, completely captured the, almost the whole map except for these two points and I was going to capture this point also. So yeah. <laughs> That is how you win against heretics in a close combat. I believe Commander Boreal is very proud of this day. He looks like he is. <laughs> yeah, I had a couple missiles, plasma guns, stuff like that. Pretty interesting stuff, yeah. The differences between uh, the, the Space Marine factions, like we can see the the classic tactical marines from the space marine have uh, missiles, heavy bolters, plasma guns and flamers but the, uh, let's say like this, blood angels got plasma guns I believe, melta guns, flamers and gravitation gun 
that's the difference between those chapters because some of them, some of them got uh, completely different upgrades for the infantry, but still they are all Astaris, they are all Space Marines. In the end of the day, I got 66 kills, 70 units lost, seven building demolished, and zero building lost. Overall, I did very good. I had better economy in both ways, in power, in requisition, and I even had better technology, so, and completely map dominance. So that's about it from this episode, I hope you have enjoyed, and we can chit-chat in the next episode.